Welcome to Ucanic. Today here in Ucanic we have a Mazda, a 2016 Mazda CX-5. On this Mazda CX-5 we have the 2.5 liter Skyactiv engine in this model. We are going to go over how you would change out your mass airflow sensor in case you've read your engine code and it's come up with the mass airflow sensor is having issues. First you're going to also check around to make sure that you don't have any leaks between um, that all these clamps are tight and connected and the hoses here connected because if you have an air leak and if this isn't it's not going to meter the air properly and so you'll check that if everything checks out good there and you can go ahead and replace your mass airflow sensor just to uh, roll that out and then of course if you if it comes back on fairly quickly then and you know that the mass airflow sensor is new it should be good then you'll also need to start looking for even more uh, maybe a deeper issue uh, somewhere where there's a hole that your air is not being metered properly so to start with we'll unhook this connector by pressing the flat tab on the mat and disconnecting and then be able to take Phillips here to undo this screws, just the two screws, and then you'll be able to pull out your mass airflow sensor. You can, um, there is a special mass airflow sensor cleaner, 50 50 chance on whether it ever works. So just get a new mass airflow sensor and reinstall. Make sure that the o ring uh, came out with the old one and that everything looks clean. So when you put your new one in, and we do our best not to touch that on anything and, and get it dirty at all. So you would just take your new mass airflow sensor when you, and be able to just insert it in there. You may need to put a teeny bit of um, lubricant on the O-ring there, just so that it uh, will slide in. But now we just install the two screws. Tighten them to snug. Reconnect the electrical connector and then you would um, clear out that engine code via a code reader or give it some time and generally your, your vehicle will talk to the ECU and clear it out if it, the repair has been fixed. Thanks for watching Mechanic, where you have been the mechanic.